The Federal Reserve did something yesterday that it's never done before. It is linking interest rates to unemployment. In other words, interest rates will not go up unless the job rate goes down. Rebecca Jarvis is here. Rebecca. Good morning. Go ahead. Well, I was going to say, Charlie, ultimately what they're trying to do with this is to discourage people from saving and to get them borrowing and borrowing cheaply. The Federal Reserve wants to stimulate the unemployment. They want to get more jobs created in this country. There aren't that many ways to do it, and they've tried multiple ways. This is a new thing, a change in their policy, and they're trying with everything that they have at their disposal to get, uh, get companies hiring in this country. So what do you think it means for consumers? What do you think it means for businesses? Consumers, they're going to get cheaper loans. Mm -hmm. Same for businesses. Ultimately, if those cheaper loans go towards buying things that create jobs, then businesses will start hiring. But if you're a saver in this country, you will continue to get paid nothing to keep your money in the bank. And that's by design. They want you spending that money. And why is the Fed doing this now? They're doing this now because unemployment has been stubbornly high for some time. And we've talked about this before, Charlie. They have changed by design their platform. They have a dual mandate to look at unemployment as well as inflation in this country. They have taken all of their focus and put it on the unemployment picture in this country because of how stubbornly high it's remained. And they're saying we're willing to let prices rise a little more than we're generally speaking comfortable with to get more people in this country jobs. Rebecca Jarvis, thanks. Good to see you.